Hello, my name is Matthew Ellison. We're in Burgos, Spain, for the European HD Summer Camp, and we have around 40 young people from eight different countries attending a week long camp which provides support and education and fun. Part of camp is getting away from what's happening at home so they can gain a better understanding of HD to help them cope with HD in their lives and also plan for the future and also we have to provide support for young people who need it and they can also have a huge amount of peer support here. Uh, so today we do the team building in the morning activities at different various stations around Burgos. It's a fantastic way for young people to have some fun but also uh, feel more comfortable at camp. In the afternoon we were looking at the Enroll HD study and the family history aspect of that which uh, involves questionnaire and looking at each individual's family history of HD, how far they can see back into their family history and that's, that's very important for research to get a better understanding of how HD works. The funding for its camp and the two previous camps have come from the European Youth in Action programme and also from the local HDAs, the Huntington's Disease Associations of the countries who send young people. The plan for the future is to try and develop local level youth services for young people in their own countries. As much as the camp's important, it's more important to have local level services that people can use when they really need them. Meet mates who like you don't have to explain your situation to because likely they're coming from the same kind of family and also it's to get information because the best way to prepare for your future and like and um, be proactive about it is to keep yourself informed. It's absolutely vital that these events continue to happen and that young people continue to have access to support and education otherwise young people are going to remain in isolation.